All right, y'all, we're going to try this song, uh, Falling in Love with Jesus. Uh, I believe it's a Martha Manuzzi tune. And, uh, may not be, maybe somebody else, but you can find it on the internet either way. And, uh, it starts off in F, okay? And it, uh, does this walk down thing that a lot of these contemporary worship songs do. And it'll go down to the, uh, from an F down to an E, and then start cycling. So we'll just we'll just kind of get into it here, and we'll show you what I mean. So you're an F. I'll go through it once, and you'll just have to excuse my uh, unbearable singing. But I'll just go through it once, and then we'll kind of break it down. Falling in love with Jesus. So you're in F. Right off the bat, you're going to go to an F major 7, which is really just a, a C with an F in the bottom. Okay? Falling in love. That's G, C, E right there. Now you can go straight to a C minor from that. You're kind of in C major there with the F in the bottom. Uh, so go from C major to C minor, and uh, you'll be going into a 251 headed to the to the four chord which will be B flat so you'll be going uh, C minor F7 to B flat more or less but we'll show you a cooler way than that to get there so you can do this falling in love and hit C minor with Jesus to F falling in love all right but uh let's trick it up a little bit do something a little bit more interesting there falling in love now to get to uh that C minor. Let's go D, G, C. So not only are you going to go 2, 5, 1 into the 4, which would be the B flat, you're going to kind of uh, 2, 5, 1 into this uh, C minor here. So you'll basically be going D, G, C, F, B flat. We're going to do that right quick to get to the C minor. Now, instead of playing a, a straight G7 to get to that C minor, we're going to play a uh, D flat 7, which will be a tritone substitution. And I don't really have time to go into it here why that works, but um, basically it has a lot of the same notes as the G7. And uh, being as we're going to a C minor, um, D flat will be a half step above that, and a lot of the notes will resolve downwards in either just a whole step or a half step downwards. And so it kind of just falls into that C minor. <laughs> All right, so it kind of sounds like this. Oh, and this will be a D minor that will hit right before that D flat seven, and this can be uh, like C E F A or C D F A. So what we have so far is falling in love with Jesus. All right. Now the next part will go. Instead of just holding on to that F7 right there, when you walk up to this A, uh, hit a B7 in your right hand, a straight B7, which will be A, C sharp, D sharp, F sharp. So you put all that together and you have this. Falling in love. You can do this with two hands, you know. Falling in love with Jesus. All right, and I don't have time to show you everything that's going on there, but uh, you can extend it out two-handed if you want to. Um, so we pick up on this part of the song. You're in B flat major seven. Falling in love, and right here you're going to be an A, C, D, F in your uh, right hand and just kind of a B flat F type deal in your left hand. 
All right, I'll walk it down with this A and have just a uh, F in your right hand, A, C, F. To a G minor. To C major 7. I'm sorry, to a C7. So it would be falling in love with Jesus. All right, but of course, we're not just going to leave it plain and simple like that. To spruce it up a little bit, you can do this B flat. Falling in love. Down to that A with the F in the right hand. And then do an A flat 7. Into the G minor 7. Alright? So it'll be like this. Falling in love. And you already know those two chords. And right here you're going to hit a, a A flat 7. Which will be D flat, B flat, C, E flat. Into a G minor 7. Which will be F, A, B flat, D. And then to the C7, which will be E, G, B flat, D. So that little deal is going to go. Falling in love with Jesus. All right, from there you're going to go to a C sharp, then back to a D minor. And if you think about the last time you were in D minor, it's going to basically repeat uh, from there all the way up. So you're going to hit... With Jesus. You hit the C7. Go C sharp. C sharp diminished, okay? Which will be uh, C sharp, E, G, B flat. Or you can invert it. I'll play it G, B flat, D flat, E. Just because it works better from where you are at in that C7. Falling in love with Jesus. See, we did that D flat into the C minor again. F7 is the best thing I've ever Alright, now, when you hit that uh, D minor and you're going through it the second time, right here, take this D and move it down a half step uh, three times, and when you do it the, the last time, you'll be on a B, a natural B which will be the 7th note of this uh, D flat 7 that you need to get to the C minor. Falling in love with Jesus. And do that same thing when you do the A, hit that B, B7 in your right hand. Alright, and then you wind up on the B flat major 7. It's the best thing I've ever, ever done. That out is just straight down from B flat to A with the F in the right hand to G minor. And then like a C sus, which would be like G, B flat, C, F. Jesus. Then to turn it around, you just do a quick D. Uh, I'm sorry, it'll be B flat to C, 7, with a D, E in the, in the bottom. Alright, so that's it. Let me see if I have time to get it all the way through there once for you. I think I do, but I'll have to kind of hurry through it. Falling in love with G. Gotta get out of here. Uh, let me know what you think. Talk to you later.